don't get to decide what kind of king you are going to be. Don't freeze. I never freeze. Wakanda offers us a glimpse into the world as it could be, self-determined and develop on their own terms without the interruption of colonialism, has figured out how to make the most of all its citizens. And so women are allowed to realize their full potential. And that's what Ryan wanted to show. And, and he committed to having that number of women around him. And they were all very specific, very individual, very powerful in our own ways and um, therefore very effective and influential. Show them who we are. This is a nation at a very, very pivotal moment in its development, you know. They have some crucial questions to answer. And so Ryan really wanted uh, the story to be led by those questions, you know. Who am I and who are my people? And the women contribute to the answering of that question, which is the way the world is. We are home. Seeing these women, you know, seeing this Dora Milaje and and Shuri, you know, these women who, who support him, he can't do it without them. He can't, you know, there is no king without a queen, <laughs> you know, is the, is the, the thought, the sentiment in, in African nations, you know. And so that queen is his mother, his sister, the all-female guard, <laughs> you know. And behind the scenes, it's Ryan Coogler with his first AD, his director of photography, his costume designer, his production designer. So. They are kings because of the queens. My king. Stop it. Letitia lights up the room as soon as she walks in. I was there for her audition, and I uh, was like, listen, all these girls are great, but what she has, you can't teach that. You know, that was my, that's my input. Now you do whatever you want to do, but I'm just saying. Yes, yes, yes. Remote driving system activated. Wait. Which side of the road is it? For bus sake, just drive. Okay, calm down. She embodies, I think, a little sister should be in a movie like this. And she brings an aspect of T'Challa out that I love being able to show. You have the wisdom of the Queen Mother and the fact that she's on the council. There's a feeling that she doesn't necessarily agree with my decision to go get Claw at this particular time. So there's a respect factor there, but then, you know, I'm my own man. With Nakia, I love the fact that she has her own mind. And I have to deal with that as a man. Okoye allows you to have another dimension in how you operate, because she's so good at what she does that she's protecting me on another level. She's like another suit. It's a very rich, experience in terms of the characters and when you think about who's playing those roles um, and being beside them every day, it's just, it's just, it's fulfilling. To have these characters that reflect that, you know, have Cherie, this young, spunky, tech-savvy woman leading Wakanda's technological charge, that's powerful and it's a really important image for young girls to get. 